What steps and actions do you have to take before owning a home? Consider the following. Have a deposit. Potential buyers should start saving for a deposit before house hunting. The greater the percentage of the deal that the buyer finances themselves, the better their chances of getting bond approval and a good interest rate. Remember that a FLISP subsidy can also be used as a deposit. Make sure your debt is under control. A better credit score will in many cases result in the lender offering you a lower interest rate on your loan. This could mean you can afford a larger house or have cash for those new home ownership expenses. Go ahead and get your free credit check with the My Bond Fitness application. Start small and build up. Your first home may not be your dream home, but it is a foot in the door and you can always build on or move into a bigger home later. Remember, affording your home loan repayment is critical. Look at your budget again and make sure that you have enough money available in your budget for the home loan repayment, administration fee, life insurance, homeowner's insurance, rates and taxes linked to the property, water and electricity costs, and if a sectional title property, levies. The lender should be able to give you fairly accurate estimate of the items listed under the bank picture on screen. Ask the agent or property developer to give you an accurate estimate of any other items. Remember that you can get an accurate estimate of your affordability if you use the online service mybondfitness.co.za. Be prepared for the unexpected. Prepare financially for possible future scenarios such as an interest rate increase or any other unplanned costs. Watch out for unplanned costs. If you are buying a property, find out if the costs for the transferring attorneys and bond registration will be included in the purchase price. This will usually be the situation if you buy in a large property development. If not, work out how much these costs could be so that you have the extra cash available to cover it as the transfer of the property into your name and the bond registration will not happen if the legal fees are not paid. To work out the legal costs and the charges, go to avidfirefly.com. Also factor in the bond registration costs. If you have to relocate, also factor in any moving costs. Visit the area. You must ideally know the general area you want to buy in and not just look at the house that you might want to buy. Getting a feel for the general area and the actual selling prices is critical. Contact us to appoint a qualified real estate agent who knows the local property market and for assistance with getting these details. Inspect the property. No matter how much you like the home or whether other buyers are also interested, make sure to take your time when viewing the property. Call in a professional home inspector if you have any doubts or questions. It is very easy to miss things when excited about a possible purchase. This could mean expensive repairs later on. Make sure that you show the deed of sale, sometimes called the offer to purchase, to a conveyancing attorney who can help you protect your rights before you buy. The conveyancer will identify shortcomings in the sale agreement and give you advice as to how it may be rectified. When you are ready to buy, first have a look at your profile on mybondfitness.co.za and check 1. Whether your credit rating is up to scratch to negotiate the best home loan deal. And 2. Is your affordability in line with the property that you want to buy? Be ready in the starting blocks for your home loan application. Once you have completed your profile on mybondfitness.co.za and uploaded your important documents like your latest proof of address, your latest payslip and your identity document, you will be able to submit your home loan application super fast without the need to complete any lengthy application forms. Your upfront preparation will make it easy to buy a home and apply for finance. If you are unsuccessful in securing a home loan for the amount you require, 
Rather than losing the home, you can always speak to the MyBond Fitness Consultant to negotiate a rent-to-buy transaction for you. So what is rent-to-buy? The animated video coming up next will provide you with more information. They say renting is equivalent to paying off someone else's bond. But getting into the property market is becoming more and more difficult. You need three to six months clean bank statements, a killer salary, and a perfect credit rating. Who has all that? <sighs> With banks rejecting 65% of all bond applications, it sometimes feels like you'll be stuck renting forever. With Rent to Buy Finance, we're flipping the script on buying a home. Here's how it works. Step 1. Find the house of your dreams. It's out there. Step 2. We'll assess your situation and verify that the home is correctly priced. Step 3. If we're satisfied, Rent to Buy will buy your dream home for you and put it on ice for 24 months. This means the price won't go up as the housing market grows. Step 4. You can move into your dream home immediately and start paying rent with the option to buy within 24 months. After two years paying rent, you should be in great shape to get approved for a bond. Rent to Buy also provides an affordability and credit score improvement service. Rent to Buy is currently open for applications in Gauteng and the Western Cape on properties priced between 400,000 Rand to 1.8 million Rand. So if you're looking for a place to call home, don't rent. Rent to buy. www.irenttobuy.co.za So, what's the next step? Get motivated. With goal set and a basic budget in hand, a debt-busting payment plan and a whole lot of information, your goals should be within reach. Remember, despite all of this, it is not easy to change one's behavior. Your changed attitude to managing your money needs to be supported by a disciplined approach. Keep on using the mobile to budget tool, even after you've become a homeowner, as it will be vital to adjust your new budget and accommodate the new home loan and expenses associated with owning a home. Remember that discipline is the bridge between writing down your goals and achieving your goals. I would like to conclude with this old African proverb. If you want to travel fast, go alone. If you want to travel far, go together. We hope that you will travel together with the advice of experienced travelers. So keep your goals in sight, remain disciplined and prosper. Thank you for completing this course.